Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you how to adjust your text on the screen so it looks good on desktop as well on mobile. Let's jump into it. Okay, so today we have uh, a question from Kara that says, so I have tried changing fonts, changing sizes, changing mobile settings, and everything else I can think of. On my computer screen, it looks right, but it never changes on my phone. Help, please. So, Kara, I'm going to go ahead and walk through this uh, for you. What I did is I tried to recreate your website the best I could over here on Angie's site, and uh, the only difference is... Um, I don't have the same fonts as you. So here's what we have right now on uh, Angie's site. And what we have is on desktop, this looks great. You know, welcome to Texas Tales, Pet Resort, and Patik. I love it. Um, obviously, your font is a little bit better. But what we're going to do is we're going to alter this. and Because when you go to mobile down here, you can see on mobile, it shows that the E gets wrapped around. So it says, welcome E to Texas Tales. And down here we got Pet Resort and Pawtique. So that is the Divi's version of the mobile context. And so I decided to go ahead and pull it up on my mobile device here. And let me show you. On my mobile device, I don't know if you can see that, but the welcome gets split up and there's the ME2 on the bottom. And then as you scroll, te Texas Tales, and you can't even get to anything on the bottom. So what I'm going to do is uh, first going to show you how to do this. Let's get back to the desktop view. Okay, so... What you had here is you have an H2 or H1 tag, H2 tag, and an H1 tag. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to change this one up here. You can see when I click on it, we have an H1 tag. So to adjust this, we need to go to design, heading text, and you need to make sure you're on the H1 tag right here because this one was H1. So then you come down here and in the heading text settings or size is just like the rest of these. There should be this little button. Uh, okay, yeah. So you got the little phone icon here. So if you just click on this icon, it'll bring up the desktop, tablet, and smartphone. And now that's three different sizes that you can have for three different applications. But remember every smartphone or every tablet or even every desktop is not the same size. So it's all dependent on the size of the screen is how things will look. So you can do your darndest to get everything looking great on one and it won't look good on the other. So what we have is on desktop, we have six, 64 pixels. On smartphone, it's 70. So you can see there. So all we're going to do is we're going to adjust this down, let's say 40. So it looks a lot smaller, but we're going to adjust the rest of these too. So we shrink that down to 40, and then you can also adjust the line height here. Uh, typically, I just like to do 1.1. Uh, and if, actually, keep that normal. Same thing, you want to click on the the uh, little mobile device and then you can shrink this one down so it's a uh, 1.2 em as where to desktop is still the default on what it is so if we we now need to go into the texas tales we're going to take this we're going to adjust the heading text and the Texas Tales was the H2 tag. So we're, we're adjusting the H2 this time. Go into Heading Text. Make sure you're on the H2. You see how everything right here changed? So we come down here, 
same thing. On desktop, it's 100 pixels. On smartphone, let's drop that down. Since we did the Welcome 2 at 40, let's bring that down to, let's say, 65. Let's see how that looks. And again, we're going to change the line height. Let's make it like, what did we do? 1.2 the other way. We'll go ahead and save that. And you can see right here on the desktop view, everything still looks good. But on the mobile view, these have shrunk down, but the Pawtik has not. So again, we're back to H1 tag. Let's get this fixed real quick. Make sure you're on H1. Scroll down, desktop is 64. We did 40 on the top, so smartphone. We'll go back down to 40. Line height, we'll change the smartphone to 1.2. Save that. And you can see on mobile, everything has already shrunk up. So you're good there. Uh, let's see, make sure there's no spaces in between there. And then go ahead and save that. So right there, you, that's pretty much all we got to do. Now, let me go ahead and come back to the screen here. And if I just refresh that. Let me try that again. Okay, there we go. Now... All right, here comes the refresh, and you can see you got the welcome is all on one line, the two wrapped below, so that's not too bad. Then you got the Texas Tales, and then you even have the Pawtik on the very bottom, and the button is starting to show through. So you can see just that quick little adjustment right there uh, really, really helped uh, adjust everything for mobile. So... If you have any other questions, you can join us on our Facebook group. Uh, that's facebook.com backslash groups backslash easy blog. Uh, I, anybody that has purchased from me, I can help do some uh, troubleshooting and you might even be featured on the next video. So if you like what you saw today, go ahead. I appreciate all forms of appreciation. And that is comments, likes, I don't know, what else is there? Oh yeah, bottles of whiskey, and obviously you need to subscribe to the page. So uh, yeah, that's it for today, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Have a good night, guys.